You won't believe how easy screen replacement can be using this plugin inside After Effects. All right, so let's say you got a clip of moving footage with somebody with a phone with a green screen and some tracking markers and you wanna add your media to the phone, but you don't know where to start? Well, follow along and I'm gonna show you. Let's start by bringing our clip inside After Effects, bring it into a comp and we can start tracking our shot. So there's other ways you could actually achieve tracking in After Effects. If you wanna know, check out my other video linked below for three ways to replace your screen in After Effects. But today we're gonna to use the Mocha AE method, which is my personal favorite. So with our clip selected, I'm gonna to go to Animation, Track in Boris FX Mocha. And from there, I'm gonna click on the Mocha icon and Mocha will pop up. So we'll start by using the X-Spline tool here and selecting the complete front of the phone to get our planar track. So now that our tracking points are selected, I'll enable Perspective as well. I'll click Track Forward and I'll speed that up for you. All right, so it's looking good. So now that it's done, I'll select my show surface and I'll adjust these blue markers here to the border of the phone screen. And I'll create one more track with the x tool and I'm gonna use this track on this little black part inside the phone. You'll see why later. And I don't even need to track this, I could just do link to track and link it to the screen layer. And when that's all done, I'll save this and I'll close out of Mocha and go back into After Effects. And I'll bring in my overlay video into my comp so in order to make this work, I'm gonna pre-comp this clip so it maintains the same proportions of the clip. In that pre-comp, I'm gonna select the clip and choose Transform Fit to Comp. So it looks a little funky, but stay with me. And I'm gonna go back into my main comp and I'm gonna hide this layer for now. Under Tracking Data, I'll click Create Track Data, select my screen, and then under Layer Export 2, I'll select my pre-comp and click Apply Export. So I can adjust the scale from here and to get it underneath the phone, I'll hide it again for now. I'll bring that on the bottom and I'll use the key light effect on my main layer to key out the green. And I'll switch to screen matte view and I'll adjust the clip black and clip white. And I'll lower my screen balance so I don't lose other details in the scene like the orange juice here. And I'll also adjust the screen gain and I'll go back to my regular view. All right, now I'll reveal my bottom layer and you see it looks pretty good. So you may have an issue with crosshairs if your green screen clip actually has these, but I'll show you how to remove them. So back in Mocha settings, I'm gonna click on Create AE Masks. And this is gonna create masks based on the Mocha layers that I tracked. So from there, I'll go into my mask and I'll subtract the larger mask and I can adjust the expansion so it actually removes the crosshairs. And my other mask layer just keeps this little black part of the phone intact. You ever start a project thinking it would only take a few minutes only to spend hours lost in menus, tools, and settings? Complex software can be a huge obstacle, especially if you're just trying to create a simple, professional design without needing a design degree. I've been there too, especially managing my channel, spending half my time just trying to figure out what tools to use. It's a serious time drain, and if you're new to design, it's easy to feel like you'll never get the hang of it. That's where Kittle comes in. It's designed to simplify graphic design for everyone, no matter your experience level. Right from the start, everything is laid out clearly so you don't waste time hunting down tools or figuring out settings. With Kittle, you could focus on being creative because the platform takes care of the technical side. From choosing fonts to adding textures and effects, it's all straightforward. And if you're a pro, you'll appreciate how it makes simple tasks lightning fast. Kittle also has a vast library of templates and assets you could use and modify to fit any project. Say you're working on a poster or social media design, you don't need to start from scratch. Just pick a template and personalize it however you want. It's as easy as choosing a design you like, tweaking a few elements, and voila! Kittle's templates are perfect for anyone who needs to create quality designs fast. And with so many options, there's something for every style and need. You could create high quality designs like this in minutes. No more fighting with software, Kittle makes it easy and fun. Want to do more advanced editing but feel intimidated? Kittle's intuitive tools make it easy. Remove backgrounds with a single click for specific edits, upscale images without losing quality, or vectorize them in seconds. Press for time? Kittle's AI Copilot is here to take over repetitive tasks. From creating unique assets to streamlining your workflow, Copilot helps you design faster without taking shortcuts. With Kittle, you don't need to be a design expert to create stunning, professional quality graphics. Get started with Kittle today and see how easy design can be. 
So now that I have my tracking looking good, I can make some final adjustments like Lumetri color. And I'll add a little glow. So I'm gonna go into my overlay pre-comp and I'll create a new blue solid. And I'll use the Venetian blind effect. I'll tweak the parameters. And I'll duplicate the effect and change one of them to 90 degrees. So that gives kind of a nice pixel screen effect. And here's the final result.